It's time to meet our pet of the week from the Roanoke Valley SPCA. And joining me to introduce us is Sylvie Peterson. Hi. Who have you brought with you today? I have the beautiful Victoria. And she's just <laughs> become this puddle of mush on me. I love her. Because she just loves warm, soft blankets. She loves the scratches beside the ear. I mean, her head. Oh, yeah. and she, she can't. She can't handle it. She's like, I'm going to roll around and just tuck my head in and oh. She's so precious. So what kind of family would be good for Victoria? Somebody who doesn't mind a lap cat. Okay. Definitely. Um, you know, it could be any type of family, but uh, she's six years old. Okay. So um, maybe not a real, real loud environment, but mm -hmm. I could just see her on somebody's lap binging. I just think if, hanging out. Why wouldn't you, you want to pet that oh all day long? God. Especially in wintertime. Yeah. I'm so toasty right now. Oh, oh she she's just so keeps, oh. cute. I love her. So um, let's talk about the home for the holidays. I mean, Christmas is, uh, it's coming up. Just a few days away. So is that still going on? Do you still have pets that are looking for a place to stay for the holidays? It is definitely still going on. Okay. And, uh, you know, unfortunately, um, the cats are being overlooked. Okay. Because we can do the home for the holidays with the cats as well. It always takes them a little bit longer to um, adjust to an environment, but it doesn't matter. Even right. if it, they're in their own room, maybe the kids' room, and they're sleeping at the foot of the bed, yeah. it's still, especially this one, she would just plop on a bed and just hang out the right. whole time. So. Uh, we probably should mention what Home for the Holidays is. You've been on before, but we are trying to get every pet, right? Yes. Every pet, a place, a warm place to stay for Christmas, for, for Christmas. the holidays. Yeah, so beginning today and tomorrow and yeah. into early Friday, you can pick up a pet, yeah. uh, fill out a foster application, and bring them home and bring them back maybe the 26th, 27th, 28th, something around that. Right. So they are out of a shelter and they are in a warm environment with family, and mm -hmm. there's warmth, and there's love, and you know, they get to experience that over Everyone the holidays. Everyone deserves that for the yes, holidays. Yes, they do, they absolutely do. And if they happen to fall in love with the pet that they bring home? Then we can help with that. Yes. We can turn that into an adoption. Fosters do get first dibs. Okay. And the thing that's cool too is if you have a family, you know, your family and friends are over, and let's say, yeah. You, you can't adopt a cat at that point or a dog, but they fall in love, we'll take your recommendation and we'll allow that adoption to happen as well. So it could extend beyond your own household. Right, yeah, so show them off cool. when everybody yes. comes over. So if somebody wants to find more information about that, if they want to sign up to do that, how, how does that work? Well, basically they can look online, but contact us. Just okay. give us a call, email us, whatever it is. We will make sure, come in, meet the animals, yeah. and find the, the one that's going to be the best fit for you. And you provide all the supplies? Everything you can think of. Food, yeah. water, litter boxes, litter, toys, um, everything. Crate, I mean. It's so simple. Yeah, it's and so simple. And it'll mean so much for these pets. That's the whole point. So if somebody wants to come meet Victoria, how can they do that? Noon to six. Okay. We're noon to six every single day will be closed New Year's Eve and New Year's Day, but we hope that they're already out okay. in a family. And, you know, I mean, we're not necessarily holding them either for home for the holidays. Right. If somebody wants to come in and adopt Victoria yeah. or another pet, they can certainly do that. Okay. But otherwise, um, home for the holidays is open to all of our adoptable pets. Okay. Sylvie, thank you so much. If you You're want a welcome. recap of this or if you want a link to their website, we'll have it on our website. Just go to DaytimeBlueRidge.com.